Hi guys, thanks for checking out this Diagnostic World video. Uh, right now we are looking at three diagnostic tools um, which are our top three picks for any Isuzu owners. Um, we've got the i905 kit, the TYT2 and the CRP123. Um, now just before we start we're not going to cover any of the uh, sort of the high-end dealer level diagnostic tools because they simply cost an arm and a leg and for any home DIY mechanic or DIY enthusiast they're simply out of price range. At the other end of the scale we're not going to cover any Chinese clones or any Chinese copy tools uh, which are illegal and will cause you nothing but problems and who knows what damage they could do to your vehicle. Uh, so the tools we are looking at are well within the grasp of any home DIY mechanic or enthusiast. Um, these particular three tools, uh, well these two in particular, I will get on this in a moment, these two will actually cover Isuzu, Lexus and Toyota. Um, there's a partnership there where the diagnostic systems, they are the same, so you'll find individual menus on them uh, for your specific car, but um, they will cover those vehicles as well. So. Don't be worried if I mention those vehicles throughout the video. So uh, what we're going to do first of all, we're going to look at the iCarsoft i905 kit. Uh, I'll show you the box here. As you can see it's a sort of handheld diagnostic tool. You won't require any pre-installing or anything like that. It will work directly out of the box. Which is why they are so popular because a lot of the laptop based software um, is actually illegal and simply will not work and will cause you nothing but headaches. Uh, so this is the, the carry pouch that it actually comes in. Just open it up here, we've got a user manual, we've got a USB port for updates, we'll come onto that in a moment. A protection sheet there, and this is the tool itself, we'll just pull it out. I'll show you the tool, so uh, that's the diagnostic plug, so that goes straight into the diagnostic port of your vehicle. So just unravel the uh, the cabling and that's the tool itself so it's got nice laid out buttons with escape okay up down left right and then obviously you've got your screen which is quite a big screen now on the screen you can look at the trouble codes you can look at the fault code descriptions uh, you can read live data from various systems uh, it'll generally cover your main systems which are engine airbag air, abs and transmission uh, plus a few more systems as well um, so this is good if you've maybe got a dashboard warning light and you want to try and check it out Find the fault yourself instead of taking it to a, a garage or a dealer Once you've bought these tools, they'll already have paid themselves Paid for themselves after using them twice uh, The amount the dealers or the garages cost to actually plug it into a machine You're looking at some 50 to 80, 85 pounds uh, Like I say, once you've used this twice, it's already paid for itself um, So that's why they are so very popular uh, People like to give you know, they like to give it a go themselves. They like to feel like they're um, sort of fixing it themselves and not being, I don't, I don't mean to say ripped off, I just, they want to sort of, it's a sense of uh, sort of achievement for looking after your own vehicle. In the sense that you're, uh, you're also learning along the way, you're not just um, handing it over, handing the car over, then receiving it back fixed, you're learning something along the way. Um, so it'll give you a unique fault code and it'll also give you a description of the fault as well, which makes the, uh, the whole process a lot easier. Uh, so we'll, we'll close this one up and then we'll go on to our next kit. So that's the first one which is the i905, excellent kit, very popular. This is the TYT2, again this is also very popular with Toyota, Lexus and Suzu owners. So it's a bigger box, it's a bigger pouch and the tool itself is also bigger. I love this tool because it kind of has a sort of a, a games console feel to it. You can look at the back there, it has like pitted areas for your hands to slot into. You plug the cable in there and the other end goes into the diagnostic port of the vehicle and then you've got a nice easy to use a nice big screen and the buttons are all very easy to use, easy to press. Um, again on this tool you'll get the same coverage as you will with the i905 so you'll get to cover your main systems, engine, airbag, ABS, transmission uh, plus more. Um, this kit has a few extra system, uh, system coverage items which this doesn't have so this will allow you to uh, diagnose and reset electronic parking brakes or APB. Um, and also it will allow you to do oil service resets 
So if you need to reset the, the service camera or the service message on your vehicle, this kit will allow you to do that. Uh, so that's why this is generally a bit more expensive than this, but um, worth it because of the, the extra features that it does have. So that's the i9, uh, sorry, no, that's the, uh, the TYT2 kit, which is another one of our top three picks. Again, you'll get free updates with this kit for life. Once new Isuzu vehicles are added onto the market, the engineers will start to make software for it, which will allow you to diagnose the vehicle, the new vehicles. Uh, so you always get free updates for these kits. If anyone's asking you to pay for updates, don't do it because they're free. Uh, and the final kit is the Launch CRP123. Now why would you choose this kit over these two kits? Well, this kit here covers a lot more vehicles than this does. These kits cover Toyota, Isuzu and Lexus cars for pretty much all of the systems within the vehicle. However, this kit covers the four main systems, so engine, airbag, ABS and transmission, but covers a wide range of vehicles. So it will cover all of these vehicles, the Toyota, Lexus, Isuzu, but it will also cover things like BMW, Audi, Seat, Skoda, Jaguar, Land Rover, Mercedes. Um, the, there's a lot of a lot of vehicles which are, I just can't pluck them off the top of my head, but it covers them. It covers a lot of different vehicles and manufacturers. Uh, so that's why you would choose this one probably over these two, because maybe if you've got more than one car in your family to look at, maybe your friends or family have a car, or maybe if you've got your next car in mind already, see you've got a, an Isuzu now, but then you're looking to maybe get a Land Rover next, it will cover that as well. Uh, so that's why uh, we've covered these two. These two are mainly geared towards Isuzu. This is, will also cover Isuzu, but also a lot of other cars as well. So, um, yeah, so if you're interested in any of these in the information box below this video, what we'll do is we'll put the links in to these kits. Uh, we have lots more videos, pictures and information on these kits showing them in action, so showing them working against vehicles. Um, you can visit the website directly, which is www.diagnostic-world.com uh, or you can click the link, uh, sorry, just go into Google and just search in Diagnostic World into Google and that will bring up our website first so you can uh, have a lot more uh, time to look at these tools. Uh, if you do need any um, questions answering, we're always here to answer your questions, so just send us a quick message. And by all means, we will answer as quickly and as honestly as we can regarding the tools uh, to make sure you get the best tool and the best advice for your actual vehicle. Uh, so thanks for watching this vehicle, uh, so this vehicle. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope it helps you make an informed decision of the best diagnostic tool for your Isuzu.